local church is partnering with the New Orleans Mission to spread a little love and a little warmth this new year. With us this morning, we have Cece Harrison of City of Love and David Botner with the New Orleans Mission here to tell us more about socks and service. Good morning, you guys. Thanks for being here. Good morning. Thank you for having us. First of all, where did the idea come from, socks and a service? Well, the City of Love and Bishop Love, you know, we have a heart for the homeless. And we just wanted to give back. And New Year's Eve, we couldn't think of a better time, a better way to bring in the new year, but none other than to just serve the people of our community. Why socks? Well, we went to New Orleans Mission, we spoke to David, and we wanted to do something that was actually needed. We were told that so many people serve food, and we've done that, of course, in the past, but we wanted to do what they needed. And so David told us undergarments, that's something that you don't want to wear if it's used. And so we're giving away 1,000 pairs of new socks. Mm -hmm. to the home. And I have to say, just new socks in general feel like love. I have to say, you put on new socks, you're like, oh, love this. David, tell us just about, you know, partnering with this church and having this event on New Year's. Well, it was great to, to meet Bishop Love, and he had such a, a genuine love for the city of New Orleans. And because they have done work in the past with the homeless, we thought it was a great partnership and a great connection. And I wanted to just echo, when you get a new pair of socks, so, so often we forget it's a little cut, a little thing that they could open up a wound and dirt and infection can set in. So it's really, it's, it's really an amazing uh, blessing that these men and women get to have this. And bringing in the new year, it kind of gives you that sense of something new is happening. Mm -hmm. But not just socks and a service. So yes. there's some ministry going on as well. Tell us about that part. Of course. That's the best part of it. The best part of it is changing lives. And that's really what the whole, the whole New Orleans Mission and City of Love Church are about. Changing lives, offering people a new start to a new year, and connecting them to the one person that we believe can change that. That's what I was just going to ask you, the significance of having the event uh, on, on New Year's. Uh, tell, tell us why, I guess. Well, our whole theme for this year was get better not just in our own lives, but to make the lives of those around us even better. And so we wanted to start the new year off by bringing that same message forth, to just tell them we're out here doing more, but we want your lives to get better. And so not only will we supply the socks, we're going to serve them a meal, but also share a service with them in their very own worship service beginning at 11 a.m. But then, of course, it all culminates we're going to do our own services, and we're looking forward to, at our location that evening, 6 p.m., 8 p.m., and 10 p.m., we'll have a service, and Bishop Love will be sharing joyous tunes, as he always does in that particular service. All right. Well, certainly appreciate you guys being here this morning. Yes. Thank you for being patient and waiting with us. We you appreciate it. Seen. Now, if you'd like to help out the City of Love and the New Orleans Missions Socks and a Service event, it takes place December 31st from 11 a.m. until 2 p.m. at the New Orleans Mission on Aretha Castle Haley Boulevard. And for more information, you can call 504-895-5410.